Congressman's home district, folks are eager to hear both what he and the president have to say tonight. News 3's Rock County reporter Margot Spann joins us now live with what residents have to say about this. Sarah and Eric, I spoke with several residents who plan to tune into the president's speech. As of November of last year, the unemployment rate in the county is more than 9%. So the word that most of them say they are listening for is jobs. People that they could have selected uh, to make this speech, he has the honor. Reverend Forrest Williams says he's looking forward to hearing Congressman Paul Ryan give the Republican response to the president's State of the Union address. I think he's going to talk about money. I think it's to talk about the fact that we have to be careful how we spend our funds and the problems we have in those areas. And uh, so I think he'll speak very much towards jobs and, and funds and uh, the tasks that uh, we have as a nation. One of those tasks is getting folks back to work. That's the primary concern for Blackhawk Technical College student David Maurer. They've tried everything they could so far. They've extended unemployment, things like that, but they need to create some more jobs. They need to put the people that are coming out of school back into the workforce. Christina Pins, also a college student, says she's eager to hear what the congressman has to say. She says having the ears of the nation could mean positive changes for Rock County. He addresses the things that are going on in Wisconsin, like all the unemployment that we definitely have here in southern Wisconsin. It could have a positive impact, on the other, and it could bring a lot of um, more insight and like eyes to what's going on in our community. Reverend Williams remains optimistic that things will only get better for Rock County residents. There, there are some encouraging things in Janesville these days, and uh, the employment rate has gone down, and we are doing better, and we ought to thank, be very thankful for that. Now, all the residents, residents rather that I spoke to say that they know change won't happen overnight with just one speech, but they are hoping that it comes sooner rather than later. All right, Margot Spann, our Rock County Bureau tonight. Margot, thank you.